So this is a review for the Curiosity Box, uh, which you can see is uh, actually produced by Vsauce. Uh, I will uh, link the, their channel uh, in the top right corner. You can click it over here. And this Curiosity Box, well, this is my first Curiosity Box, so I don't know what I'll find inside. But as you can see, uh, from outside, uh, the design is quite unique. And this is actually how you get it. You don't get it inside any like uh, bag or something. You, the, it is, it comes just like this inside uh, nothing. And as you can see, it got a little bit damaged by the mailing uh, companies. Uh, I'm actually living in Israel, so uh, here the mailing company is not so great. But I'll leave it to you to decide. So this is, as I said before, this is my first curiosity box. So let's open it up and see what's inside. So let's find where it opens here. Let's cut the tape. Okay. And let's hope there is nothing inside that says who I am. Let me just look. No, it is actually an inception. There is another box inside the box. Just kidding, it's not a box. Okay, as you can see, there is actually something, some kind of... Oh, it's, a, it's an explanation of uh, stuff which you can find inside, I think. Um... I think it's, I think, well, let's see, but I think it is what's inside this curiosity box. So let's look inside. And there is some kind of a book that it is titled the Curiosity Solar Eclipse. Okay, something about the solar eclipse, probably what was in the solar eclipse that was in the States a few weeks back of the recording of this video and here's some welcome and some chapters <laughs> some cool pictures of the squid of the curiosity squid it's cool and some scientific explanations probably about the stuff that's inside yeah I could see the same glasses here it's, you can see the glasses over here and the book over here or whatever it is so you can see it's the same thing so probably this is what I'll find out in the curiosity box so yeah you can see the where you could see the eclipse in the states and this are probably the glasses for the eclipse and you can see the picture of uh, Michael from Visas and some scientific explanations. Uh, okay. And other interesting, probably, stories. Okay, I'll read them later. What else there is here? Okay, so let's try and figure out what's, what is it. Mobile microscope. Oh my god, really? It is a microscope, I'm reading it right, right? It is a mobile microscope. It is something that you put, look at the squid, at the picture. It is something you put on the phone. Here it is, I don't know if you can see it from the reflection, but it is a microscope that you put on your phone. That's so cool. Oh my god, I'll review it later, but it looks very cool. Okay, what is it? Okay, it turns around, so it's already good. Curious creatures. Ha! Okay, now I see what they, do, what they did here. Nikola Tesla. 
So it is Nikola Tesla, but it is a sloth. Collectible animal pin. I hope they'll mail it every time with the curiosity box, I don't know. And here's some explanation, you can pause and read it. And of course it made, it's made in China, but it's amazing, it's cool. Okay, what else? Um, I know levating rings. Oh, that's cool. Probably there are some kind of magnetic rings that levate and you can do stuff with them. I'll review it later. Okay. Okay, what else? What else is inside? Something big. Okay, another big box. Let's... Well, I, I don't really know what it is. It's partially open, probably because of the packaging. Oh, it's it's a shirt. It's a t-shirt. I can throw the box away. And let's look at the t-shirt. Okay. Let's move the box aside for a second. And the t-shirt. Let's make sure it's my size. Yeah, it's my size. Okay. Oh, it's a Voyager 1. Cool. And it's probably with some stuff that I don't really know about the Voyager 1. Like... I don't know, the frequency, the sound it sent. I'll probably need to read about it, about the shirt it's probably explained in the in the book i showed earlier okay what else can we find here these are the glasses oh and they give you two glasses probably for you and for your wife or girlfriend or whatever or friend if you come to look uh, for the clips together so these are eclipse glasses too late for me yeah because the eclipse is over but Maybe the next next eclipse. So there you go. And the travel patch. That's cool. You'll uh, you put it in on some bag or something with a cute uh, octopus or uh, whatever you call it, which wears Vistel's hat. That's cute. Cool. And what what is it? Some kind of sticker. Temporary tattoo. Oh, it's not a sticker, it's a tattoo. Um, okay, Visa's Artist Spotlight. Okay, I don't really know what special meaning it does it has, but I'll probably read about it and it has some meaning, I hope so. And it's not just some kind of tattoo. <clears throat> okay, cool. There is a book. Really book. Real not really thick, but it is actually a book. Curiosity box official. And cross section castle. Okay, but let's see what's inside this book. Okay. Some oh, it's probably some historic descriptions and stories about this castle, the Stephen Best Bestis castle, and there is some cross sections of it and explanations of what you see the thick walls number two. And they are numbered here, okay? You can see this cross section, so it's probably explaining uh, all the stuff about the, the castle. So this is like a historic point of view of uh, science. That's also cool. And I don't really understand what is it. There is some kind of game, Steam game included in here. Oh, and some kind of gift card. 
for universe, universe sandbox. Probably the Steam game is some kind of credit you can buy on the game, I don't know. I'll need to look it up. Okay, I'll make another video about it. And that's it. That's all the box. And so to summarize, there are quite a, a lot of stuff there. History stuff, like the book, the scientific stuff, like, uh, like the microscope. Okay, here's the microscope. Scientific stuff. Uh, just uh, stuff to, I don't know, to, to put in your bags and your... Uh, uh, and some stickers, okay, to remember the curiosity box. And some uh, other life event stuff, also scientific. And other scientific toy. Uh, some... Uh, a book, a history book. So it's not also only... Um, it's not only like... Uh, math science, but also history science as well, included. And... And uh, there's a shirt. You actually put your size, uh, your t-shirt size. Oh, I didn't see it. From the back, you can see some life events, so some dates uh, of where the probably it, where the Voyager One was at every single date. Like you can see that. At where is the date? 2025. It will. It's in the future actually. Ability to power instruments is lost. So this is where they expect the power to be dead and gone for the Voyager. And this is actually the unplanned tour. Probably where it will end up. <laughs> and you can see here where the golden record which is uh, inside the Voyager 1 like in 1 billion years it won't be readable so by then no one could really read what's on it so as you can see there's a lot of stuff here and this is only one curiosity box uh, I'll do an, a separate video for each and every part of the curiosity box by itself so for now that's it and just one final thing that I want to show you is wait a minute let me just grab my cam so this is on the inside of the box within the sea is where I live I love to learn and think my full name is inquisitive but you can call me ink okay so this is his name this squid so his name is Inquisitive, and I'll call it Ink because he told me you can, I can call him Ink. So this is Ink, and that was the Curiosity Box Review. See you next time.